In order to give your students editing access to your site, you'll need to go up to More Actions and Share This Site. This is also the location that you use to change the security settings on who can actually see your site. So you'll have to decide how you want to handle that. Public, where anyone can see it, anyone with the link, or private, and only those people granted permission. I don't want to change that at this point, but if you want to add people, you would just put an email address in here. Like that. And it will also show you your contacts as they come up. Now I've already done this, and I put my Comcast email in there that I hardly ever use, and then I clicked on Share. Once that happened, I go to my Comcast email and it sends me this message. And then I can click it to open. Now here's how this works. And I go to Google Sites, I can see that I now have editing options. So you'll have to do that for each student in your class. They'll have to have a valid email address. But after you do that, you've got full editing access to this site as you can see with edit pages.